Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. Well, there are plenty looking forward to seeing this. A capacity crowd here. Yes, Peter, it's a shame it's only a, a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair, skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. There's the whistle. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Yeah, Bernd Leno. I think his presence might make all the difference for this team. He's got lightning-fast reactions and uh, a coolness under pressure that allows him to make the big one-on-one -on -one saves. He's also very reliable under the high ball or when he's dealing with crosses, and I'd expect the whole defence to play with a bit more assurance with him in place. He would be the obvious choice, wouldn't he? He certainly has all the right qualities. And the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Oh, great ball! He's gone for it! It's in! Arsenal take the lead! Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Well, that has certainly made things interesting. Ferran Torres. João Cancelo. De Bruyne. Ferran Torres. Ferran Torres! Cedric Suarez gets it away. And it's De Bruyne. Aubameyang. Aubameyang tries leading the charge, but he's having to go it alone. Aubameyang. Arsenal have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not. And they've been caught out here. De Bruyne. Greenish. De Bruyne. And it's Gundogan. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Grealish, De Bruyne, Ferran Torres gets it, and now what?
Now it's Aubameyang. Tierney. Finds himself eased off the ball. Gabriel Jesus. Cedric Suarez. And here's Aubameyang. Gabriel Jesus. Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? Ferran Torres. Peter, we can only applaud that quality of tackle in the circumstances. It was probably goal-saving. It's being played forward. That has put a stop to that. OK. Bernardo Silva, and it's played forward. It's a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Xhaka goes looking. Tierney. Across the field it goes, and it's Suarez. Forward it goes. Grealish. Hoists it high. And the shot! It's there! They are right back in business. Yeah, the pass was bang on, and he just had to ensure he didn't stray offside. The finish was actually bang on too. has certainly made things interesting. Yeah, it's a very good contest with two very good sides and with such great individual talent on show, it could go either way. Hoists it forward. Has he found his man? And that's been one straight back. Keeper's got good distance on that. That will be the last act of the first half. What it has been, an even contest, as the scoreline suggests, and it has been more than decent to watch. Station and focus now, just to try and get a little control on this game. So, both teams heading off for the break. An interesting game has brewed up here, hoping perhaps for a little bit more from both parties in the second half. But the score at half-time is 1-1. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. Manchester City can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and pop. Real chance! And it's Gundogan. Gundogan. Gabriel Jesus. And the chances keep on coming. They're awarded another corner. Grealish plays it short. And here's Grealish. Can he deliver?
Left one out for a throw in. Out again for a throw in. Bernardo Silva. Xhaka demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. Plays it through. He's still going. Where to next? Played in deep. Hits one! Plenty waiting in the middle. In again. Shapes the shoot! Oh, taken with style! Into the lead once more. Arsenal get themselves into the lead. De Bruyne. Kyle Walker. De Bruyne. João Cancelo. Tries lifting it over. And that's been lever clear. That's what has to be done now. No question about it. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Spot on, Peter. Looks to dink one in. Ball's gone out of play. Well, there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Got the ball glued to his feet. It's out for a goal kick. But there's going to be another change here. Bernardo Silva. De Bruyne. Gundogan, João Cancelo. Now it's Gundogan, Cedric Suarez. Gundogan has been caught there. It's a foul. Mahrez really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. Tries to get it forward quickly. That's a good foot in there. Forward it goes. Good one. There's the through ball. It's got his head. Manchester City are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Tierney, well weighted. Shot a goal! He scored! And surely that does it! Perfect time, decisive strike.
Oh, a goal of real quality. He made it look ridiculously easy. Well, most of those go high and wide because of their difficulty. He made it look like he does it every day. So the lead now is two. De Bruyne. Ferran Torres looking as though he's being given special treatment here. Treatment he could well do without. Yeah, Peter, and it looks like this defence will go tooth and nail to prevent him from, um, from getting another. De Bruyne with the short one. Nicely controlled. De Bruyne delivers. And that's a ball to nobody in particular. Has gone out. Final checks on the touchline. A change about to occur. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag. And he was never going to last until the final whistle. De Bruyne. Goes for goal! He has done it! And what a climax we have here! Just so calm under pressure. Well, I think that defence there thought they were in good position and they had him where they wanted, yet somehow he's worked the scoring position when it didn't see him on. It's really crafty business, that. We have got ourselves a game here. Holding. Holding goes looking. Arsenal have it back and they can go again. Hoist it forward. Into a minimum of four minutes additional time. Gets wrestled off the ball. João Cancelo. Going nowhere fast is about the only way I can describe this. They've just got to be busier. Bernardo Silva. And it's Mares. Kyle Walker. Mares. Kyle Walker. He has it out wide now. Lovely feet. One good cross, maybe the last chance. Has a goal! Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. A fine advertisement for attacking football, a really entertaining game. So many talking points. In a way, a shame anybody had to lose. How would you summarize?